the end of 2023. Hello guys, so the physio, hope you're having a wonderful day. If not, sit back, relax, and enjoy the video. Now today, guys, as usual, it's the end of the year, man. We're here with a end of year video. Um, I did this for the first time in what, 2019? And just ever since, I always give the same explanation, but ever since, just been doing it every year. And I think it's just gonna, like I said last year, it's gonna continue, you know how I know? Because I watched it before, look, this video, like I do with every end of year video, to remember what I talked about <laughs> in the last one. But yeah, end of the year, I just wanna give a huge shout out and a big thank you to you guys for the tremendous support you have shown on the channel this year whether it be just youtube or just twitch or both I understand everything you guys you know i've done just amazing and I, I cannot stress how much it's appreciated in terms of what we did this year i'll be honest again it sounds bad but it, we didn't really do anything too new or slash innovative i'm gonna be 100 percent honest but again there's another side to that coin we've kind of done everything when it comes to pokemon like nozzle looking formats and stuff like that but there's a few things i've kind of ventured into doing and want to do there was one thing i did want to do this year one of the collab projects was a soul link i was talking about in last year's video and it's not been able to fall together we did record the first episode and then it's been a very long time i'm just fumbling the bag at this point i should have put my foot down and had that recorded as soon as instead of you know just thinking hey yeah we'll, we'll do it don't worry so that's my fault but i guess in terms of new things that we did if i can think off the top of my head we i, I changed the style of my thumbnails i kind of like this new style it, it, it's, it's pretty cool i still like the old style as well like how you're seeing the pokemon white wed lord thumbnails the blazing emerald one that one was really good um, i still will use those thumbnails but i think for now it will only be for certain game like if i want it to be like that for a main series on the channel or which one i'm probably going to use it for for side series like you're seeing with the wedlock live let's plays of pokemon games i don't know if any of that made any sense but anyway that's the main thing but that is one big change that we had in terms of comparisons to last year this year and all that shit oh and the co-op came back soft little reboot when will the next co-op come god knows you want me to be for real only god knows i, I swear to god i don't know none of us know we don't know you, you want to know why can't tell you why we, we generally don't know all right in terms of like statistics i guess and i don't like to talk about this shit but here's what it is end of the day but last year we ended on 102,574 total channel views this year we ended on 154,183 channel views which is nice it's pretty cool the thing is though what's pissed me off this year about the channel is youtube taking views away from my videos it happened a couple times with the wally quest series a lot with omega paradox uh, views were just getting chunked off my videos and i was like what's going on bro and it really it's really annoying i found out the reason why i forgot who told me but it's a stupid reason anyway but yeah total channel views pretty cool i guess <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is such a bad video, but yeah, in terms of last year's videos that had 1k plus views, we had 19 in total this year. 26, again, pretty cool. We had three, maybe four videos this year hit 1k views, and a couple that have kind of come close. I know the final episode on Water Blue was really close to 1k views. Some videos this year hit 1k views that were old videos, a good example, which was one I was keeping an eye on because I actually really wanted this to hit 1k. It was the only video I cared about <laughs> hitting 1k, I'll be honest, was the Redux co op first episode, though, again thank you to anyone that's viewed it and any other videos on this channel of course in terms of subs again in last year's video i didn't mention how many subs we, we had but i had to check the youtube analytics which is i don't know how to navigate through because i don't use it but i found out 545 was how many subs we ended on last year so pretty solid amount 200 and something very very good year for the channel i think in general like we've had so many videos like do well so many series being well received it's a shame that i couldn't do any other videos that i promised like solo stuff that's the thing like i'm kind of annoyed about myself with is the fact that certain videos that i promised i wasn't able to deliver and do one again this spin-off video i've been talking about for the past two years i just haven't gone to recording or anything and now that i think about it i think i'm not gonna do it until it's my 1000th video and that is 100 videos away so yeah this will when this comes out, i'll be 99 videos away but yeah so when will that be i don't know but i will not upload until that video is out on the channel when it comes to it so we there's a chance the channel could be at a stalemate stuck on 999 videos so who knows how long that would take but yeah in terms of like what i wanted to do for this year i know i wanted to do like old school games and stream on the youtube channel again which i have been doing and i have achieved that which i'm very happy and thankful for we are definitely going to finish up the retro games that i wanted to do for the summer it's freaking december now it's going to be january but we, we managed to finish star wars and hey, what was the other game rayman too boy. shame we couldn't do harry potter this year but we are going to do it pretty much next year in january hopefully and other live let's plays as well that i've talked about we did do a god run for the first time 
sometime this year. I'd love to start doing more rock challenge runs like that. I wouldn't mind. The God one is a pretty cool concept on Crush Team Race. It's a game that I really like anyway. Even if I rage, I'm still enjoying playing the game. You know, it's like, like I said, it's a game I can't get bored of. I definitely wouldn't mind trying to start speed runs at some point. Maybe next year we might have our first ever speed run. I mean, I have been doing speed runs this year on the Twitch channel, the PVE events and stuff like that. I will be doing a speed run on Tuesday, so two days after this video comes out, Twitch channel. So check that out for one of the PVE events. Be a children stream. I, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm probably gonna do a lot of stuff. Open packs from a new box. Probably maybe do a bit of PVP. It might be a long stream. I can't lie. What was intended to be a short stream will be a very, very long stream. Who knows? Uh, it depends how I feel. But yeah, just so much like I'll be honest, this year was a lot better than last year in terms of uploads. Cause I, I I've been I'll be honest, not to you know gloat or toot my own horn. I've, I've been doing posting a lot of videos this year. A lot more than last year. I haven't been as lazy, even if I've been lazy to edit, the videos have been consistent. You know, we had so many series this year. If I look from the playlists, what let's plays did we do? Galaxy Emerald, a Pokemon Y Sleeplock, White Randomized Wedlock, we did Water Blue, Sleeplock Versus. That was the first thing, that first time I ever did that, so I guess that's a new thing we did this year. Star Wars Phantom Menace, Rayman 2, Wally Quest, Blazing Emerald, Freeway Cop, which was Pokemon Wish, Omega Paradox, Pokemon Sapphire. We did like daily sleep logs for our Twitch celebration, I think it was, which was what, Leaf Green, Spyro 2, Crash Nitro Car on the Game Boy, Crash Team Racing, Pokemon Vega. We did a Versus for the first time on the channel. That was the main thing, which was with Sleepy, the Pokemon Green Versus, which was really fun. We did, I think the Mega Ruby sleep log was the New Year's sleep log. Uh, funny enough, tomorrow we will be doing a New Year's sleep log and we'll be Pokemon Ruby. <laughs> it'll be Pokemon Ruby, uh, randomized. I randomized the ROM a very long time ago and I feel like it's gonna screw me over. I hope not. And yeah, a lot, a lot of stuff done this year. Honestly, uh, I, I guess you can count Sweet Tooth because maybe it went into the New Year. I don't remember when Sweet Tooth was done. Hey, after, like, maybe yeah, towards boy. the end of Storm Silver 2, if you want to count that. But yeah, that's a, that's a lot, man. I don't know how many of you guys were keeping track of how many series I mentioned there, but we did quite a lot this year. And I, and I think I should be proud of that. You know, I'm quite negative minded sometimes. And I think definitely, definitely should take some positives out of this. Next year for what I want to do. I mean, I didn't want to reveal the games. I may as well. I'm not going to tell you which order they're happening in. Definitely will do Renegade Platinum. That's I think that's the next solo Nuzlocke. I know I wanted a bit of a longer break from playing more enhanced difficult games, but I swear to God, every game is just enhanced or difficult. And it's really annoying because instead of, and I said this many times, instead of making an actually innovative game that's fun, has a good story, really cool set pieces, you know, something really memorable. Most ROM hackers nowadays want to make ROMs just difficult. And it's just like, come on, what's the fun in that? We have Driano for that. We have so many other people for that, <laughs> that, I've, that I don't know the names of, but you know what I'm saying? But the game, games I want to play, I definitely want to do, you know, Renegade Plan or what to expect in 20, yeah, let's do this. What to expect in 2024. Uh, these are just stuff I've written down for what I want to play. Pokemon Renegade Plan, of course. Pokemon Altered or Alter Alt Red, I don't know how to say it. Pokemon Inclement Emerald, I've talked about. Pokemon Inverse Platinum, I definitely want to play. Definitely want to do a live Let's Play of Crash Nitro Kart uh, on console. Pokemon Sword and Shield GBA. I definitely want to do a Pokemon Double Battle, a randomizer Double Battle. I don't know if it's going to be a stream or a Let's Play, probably most likely a stream. I definitely want to do that and maybe attempt a Hardcore Nuzlocke for the first time. We shall see. And again, I don't care if I do a Hardcore Nuzlocke on a very easy game. It's to start things off. You have to warm yourself in. You can't go straight to the Lions then unless you just want to really rough upbringing and be you know go for it hopefully some more collabs can happen we, i was meant to do a yugo collab i don't know what happened to that maybe i should message the person i'll probably end up forgetting i definitely want to do the 1k celebration like reaction video to like my old videos i wanted to do that this month but yeah i guess this comes towards the negative side of this year uh, it was this month honestly i felt very burnt out very stressed very very tired um it was a good idea at first you know demon time december you know go crazy with the content do god runs on mondays halo on tuesdays all this shit, you know, Pokemon Water Blue, finish that off, Galaxy Emerald, along with Pokemon White on the weekends, have a sleep off ch chucked in there, you know, finish off the Star Wars Let's Play. Realistically, successful month in doing that, very tiring and very stressful, you know, and probably not the best month for me, you know, and I'm kind of annoyed with Pokemon Galaxy Emerald. I don't know if you can tell, spoilers, I'm sorry if you didn't see it and now you're seeing it, now that I've mentioned it, but just... I don't know if you can, like I said, I don't know if you can tell, but I'm just not enjoying the game. From start to finish, I haven't enjoyed it at all because it's just Pokemon Emerald. And it annoys me because I could have played a much better Pokemon Emerald, which was Inclement Emerald. It really upsets me knowing that. So now, yeah, that, that's going to be put in, in 2024, Inclement Emerald. 
Um, oh, another game. I definitely want to sleep lock Shiny Sigma Gold. I know we're currently playing that on EJ's channel on the four-way versus, but I definitely will sleep lock that. I, I don't know what celebration it'll be for, but I definitely want to do a sleep lock of that game because the game is shit. I want to prove like I can beat this game normally with grinding and playing properly, you know, uh, with speed up and stuff like that. Maybe it will change my outlook on the game. Oh, and another thing, the weekend league returned this year. It was, we did it yesterday. Thank you to everyone that came by and you know played, watched, whatever. Honestly, thank you. It was very well received. It was our fourth one. We haven't done it for a long, long hiatus a very very long hiatus but yeah hopefully within 2024 we should do it we should we should be doing it more often of course twitch streams will always be the same still be doing that still be doing tournaments pvp stuff all that good shit uh speed runs you know what i'm saying just the same old same old and always aiming to do better definitely want to get invest in some emotes the main issue with that is finding an artist to do the correct style and the second issue of that is ideas the third issue is money and they can be quite expensive so i haven't really invested in that so if anyone that's here from the twitch channel if you've got this final video i'd be very surprised anything else for me to add uh, I think about it. I'm not too sure. I feel like when I finish this, I'll be like, oh, I should have said that. Oh, why didn't I say this? But it is what it is, end of the day. But 2023, it's been a good year. Hopefully, I can continue feeling motivated. In terms of, you know, what's happening. So, this coming week, so tomorrow, we're going to do Pokemon Ruby Randomized Sleep Lock. Tuesday, we'll have an episode of Pokemon Galaxy Emerald. I think it's episode 6 we'll be dropping. Yeah, yeah, episode 6. Uh, Tuesday, we'll also be streaming on the Twitch channel. We'll do the speed run, like I said, open packs in a new box, all that good stuff. Wednesday, another up. So, you get... Three, two, two consecutive uploads. Galaxy Emerald will be up on Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Twitch streams, and then Saturday. Yeah, Saturday will be uh, Galaxy Emerald episode eight. And hopefully that weekend, maybe start Harry Potter. Part of me doesn't want to because the week after, so from the 8th to the 14th of January, there will be no uploads on the YouTube channel. I'll be taking a one week break. In my opinion, a deserved one week break from constant uploads and stuff like that throughout December. But yeah, another thing I definitely want to continue is the God Runs. I've been enjoying that. I think I won't do them as frequent. It'll be a spontaneous Monday. I'll just go live. Let's play some Crash Team Racing. And another one I definitely want to do as a Let's Play. I don't think I'm going to do Lasso on Halo 1. I think I'm just going to have it as just play on legendary campaign co-op with Yusuf and Sleepy or just me and Sleepy whoever it, it doesn't matter or rotate them in and out it, it doesn't matter because you can mission select anyway definitely want to do that I feel like this year outside of the YouTube channel just gaming in general I feel like I'm going to challenge myself more and do more difficult stuff and challenging games well, not even challenging games I, I'm kind of doing that more and I feel like I should have done that when I was younger because I'm older now I ain't the same when it comes to games but it is what it is man uh, we'll see but yeah I think that's it oh, this video is what 15 is 16 minutes bro I wanted this to be like 5-6 minutes long and it's yeah. Anyway, look, happy new year. I hope you guys are safe. If you're celebrating tonight, please be careful. Please be safe if you're going out and stuff. If not, I hope you enjoy your night regardless. And yeah, let's hope we will have a safe 2024 and hopefully a successful 2024 for all of us. Hopefully for the channel. And yeah, honestly, thank you guys so so much for your support this year on both Twitch and YouTube. It's it's been amazing. I can't, I can't stress or oh, thank you guys enough. Um, oh yeah, another thing, I, I guess I forgot, it's not really to do with the YouTube channel, but meeting a YouTube friend, like, for the first time, abroad, you know, first YouTube friend I met was SB, but, like, abroad, really hit home, man, um, so again, thank you so much, uh, Brandon, for, you know, having the funds, or make, making sure you have the funds, being able to come out, Danny, I know you were meant to come out, and I, I'm thanking you too, for dedicating your time and having the funds too, because you did pay for your ticket, it's just unfortunate and a damn shame, the passport situation, but regardless, I'm still happy to be friends with you guys and everyone else, that's part of the channel and part of my journey uh, for YouTube so again thanks so much big love to everyone honestly thank you thank you I don't know what I need to outro this video I'm gonna edit this I need to go out <laughs> it's Lewis's birthday we're going to play golf <laughs> I do have gameplay prepared for this luckily so it shouldn't be up too too late again thanks so much for the support this year God bless you all let's all have a wonderful wonderful 2024 and I wish you all Happy New Year